Good afternoon. I'm Erin, an occupational therapist at CDRC, and this is Annabelle. And we're here to talk to you today about the activity called Hungry Tennis Ball. So as you can see here, we've used, <laughs> we've used just a standard tennis ball, and we've cut a hole to make a mouth. On the sides, we've added dimples so that the kids will know where to put their fingers to squeeze the mouth open, and then just decorated the face for fun. To make the activity a little more interesting, we take some homemade Play-Doh, and we can make a treasure hunt using coins or beads or whatever small objects you have around the house. And we hide the coins inside the Play-Doh. We'll just do two right here. And then, here, sit up. Um, then the child will get the coins out of the Play-Doh, one at a time. That uses some nice pinch movements <laughs> and dexterity to find the coins and to um, some stereognosis to find the coins. And then you'll be able to squeeze and place the coin into the tennis ball. What's, what's helpful is to do this evenly using one hand to place a coin in and the other hand to squeeze and then switching hands so that both hands get even work for the activity. Go ahead and place it in. You can also grade it up or grade it down by having you squeeze and then put the coins in as we just demonstrated or they can hold it for you and squeeze it. Can you hold it for me? And squeeze it open. And then I can put the coins in so that everyone can do exactly what is best for them. Um, just make sure that there's supervision, obviously, since there are small pieces in this activity. Thanks.